What's up guys, it's No Joe Cow. We're coming at you live from my favorite shooting location here in Phnom Penh, Cambodia. Now, as some of my viewers know, as some of my viewers know, my mother actually moved to Phnom Penh recently, about maybe six weeks ago, like a month and a half ago. And uh, so I've got a lot of requests. P people want to see what she thinks about Cambodia, what she thinks about me or life here, her complaints. So we're going to make a few videos today. And, <laughs> and, uh, <That's> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> all right, y'all. So without further ado, here, here is, uh, here's No Jokes Mom. All right. What's up? Hi, how are you doing? <laughs> all right. So, so, so people want to hear what you think about Cambodia. Like, can you, can you like talk about just briefly, like, like, like what got you to come here basically? I mean, like, why? Oh, you did. I did, right, okay. And I couldn't have come here without uh, divorce funds. Divorce funds? Mm -hmm. Okay. And so I actually was going to start out in Western Europe, as you know. It was my lifetime dream. And I just figured that, you know, you're here, so why not come here? And yeah. Why not live here? Why not? I mean, Embrace it. my mom is officially the only person I could fully trust here in, in, in this town. I mean, like, I just know lots of people. I don't have lots of friends, per se. Like, I know lots of people. But it's just nice to know that I've got family here. You know, it's nice. It's nice. I'm sure it's nice for you to know you have family here. And you do have some really nice friends. I. Uh, you have some nice friends. I and do. You have, you have different types of friends. I have different. I have yeah. different. Sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. we'll, we'll just. I digress. Um, <laughs> I digress. So 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 like when you first saw my videos, you didn't really like them. I was uh, I was freaking out. I thought, oh my God, he's saying fuck this, fuck that, fuck you, you know, uh, racist things. Racist but, things like what? Well, I love when racist. people say that I say racist shit, and then I ask for I ask for an explanation, and they say, oh well, I don't know. Okay, let's say this: you stirred the pot a lot, stirred but the pot that a lot. stimulates that doesn't, conversation. That doesn't mean I'm racist. Well, I hate everybody equally, man. I hate white okay, people. Okay, that's fair. Fuck white people. Taking over the planet. Shall you die, digress? The, sm the smallest, the smallest race on the planet. Only eight percent European white, and we still run shit. That's right. Anyway, so you saw my videos, and you got divorced from dad, and you didn't like your job, and blah blah blah. Just like so many other people around the world. I was over America. I was had, over yeah. materialistic uh, living and that, right. you know values. There's so much more to life. You know what I feel inside. I want to bring out. I want to contribute to society. I want to have something good to say and make it worth my time. And yeah, and like, yeah, you know. Yeah. I love your videos now. You, you actually, uh, I, I'm really proud of you. Oh. You're really, you're, you Thank really you. do have something to say. Thank you. Thank and you. And your delivery. My delivery is a little it. more on point and, you know, yeah, I mean, like, that's, like, that's, that's, that's how it was before and I, and I make no apologies and I'm. Yeah, I mean, like that, that was just my style, man, and uh, that's that's that style, that attitude's got me to where I am now, you know, in terms of my channel. So, anyways, so you get a plane to Cambodia, like, what was your first immediate impression when, like, when we got out on the tuk tuk, you know, cause she, cause she got there, we we go out to the tuk tuk, and the tuk 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 take took us some goddamn. A lot of tooks it's that. hot as fuck here. It's hot as fuck. You want to move in the shade? Yeah, could we please? And I, but that's what I thought on the tuk tuk right away. It's hot, it's hot as fuck here, guys. Yeah, uh, I loved just basically looking at my surroundings and uh, and just uh, having your arm around me, and I, was oh. just, I felt like I was at home already. Yeah, you're pretty sweet. <laughs> but um, just like over here, how beautiful is that? The little how boys, the little boys that? and girls bathing naked. I mean, yeah. Why look, not? Look, he's like thrusting his, like thrusting his shit out. He's oh, peeing. he's taking a piss. He's peeing. Oh my god. It's a sheet. That's a sheet. That's oh, a sheet. Yeah. There's I just no figured. I just. Hanging. I just figured that's a. Uh, oh, never mind. So. So yeah, it's very hot so it's here. Not, okay. it's well, very, that's, very that's, hot. that's obvious. But like, in terms of how about the people? What, what, what was your first impression of the Cambodian people? Now choose your words carefully here. Choose the word. No, I'm kidding. Say however the fuck you want to say My it. My first impression? What was your first impression of the Khmer people, just in general? Okay, in general, I just couldn't stop looking at them because there's such a diversity in how they look. But there seems to be one whole, you know, thing that they have the same. And, um, okay. yeah, cultural, there, I know you don't like the word cultural, but it is cultural. I only like cultural when it's said like this. When it's Cult said like this? Cultural or culture. Okay, well, it doesn't, it, I use the word culturally as a blessing. Um, what does that mean? I think it's a blessing to learn other cultures and okay. to adapt to the way of life sure. that they have. Yeah, you know, fair um, enough. 
I feel that I should be learning Kamai, I can say Akun. That's, you know, I mean, like, you didn't even say that right. There, 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 there's people right now watching this video saying she just fucked that up. Yeah. Akun. I can fuck up. That's cool. Yeah, no, no. Akun. I believe it's Akun. And when I, I tell somebody know. my See, name, I, I fucked it up too. If I say, say my name is Kim, they say Kim. They can't say Kim. Yeah, it. exactly. So I'm here to teach grammar and phonics. When well. when I was on my when I was on the buy on TV fight when I remember remember my last fight where I broke my hand. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um. Well, yeah. I, and, and and the dudes were calling me Bristol Novara. They even they even um. They even put that on my check because I because I got paid like not much. You don't make much here in Cambodia, but um, I did get my 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 fight purse and it was Bristin Novara, like spelled like Novara, like like I'm a Japanese guy or something. So maybe you are completely fucked it up, but yeah. whatever, man. Yeah. Um. So, all right. So you you've been here for like six weeks now. Mm -hmm. What is your what what would you say that you miss about America? If you, I don't know, like if you had to pick something, like a couple things from back, back home, like what would you say you miss? And besides your family, besides your family, because that's and obvious. And my boyfriends. All your, all your countless boyfriends. Um, <clears throat> well, that's, that's a, a hair, you know. Uh, what do I miss the most? Um, to be honest, maybe, maybe the luxury of having air conditioning all the time, all the time. And not having to pay, what was your bill like? Well, my bill here was one hundred and twenty nine dollars and fifty cents because you were using AC twenty four seven and a ten by ten hundred square foot room. Yeah, you know? I mean, her and room is the awesome. size of a shoebox, and she has her AC going twenty four seven. So yeah, I mean, this shit, this shit's gonna add up. Well, I mean, just I mean, like regardless of the size of the room. I don't but, mind um, paying for that luxury, though. I don't mind paying fair for enough. that. Other what else? things I, I miss, I miss swimming. I miss swimming in fresh water. Fresh oh, water. like a freshwater lake. Yeah, I miss I miss swimming in freshwater lakes. Uh, when, when's the last time you went swimming in a freshwater lake? In Virginia. Where? Oh my gosh, I'm trying to think. It was in uh, Harrisonburg. It was by Harrisonburg, Virginia. I don't want to go into the whole story. Oh. I swam in a lake. Okay. Oh. Oh. I digress. Oh. All right, mom. Um. Okay, so what's what's one thing that you I guess don't miss at all like like in terms of like in terms of the way things are done in America like business or, or I do government. not miss oh okay I, what I do not miss is she's got all serious guys watching television oh yeah and all the media hype and the lies and consumerism the materialistic values uh, <laughs> I mean hey you asked me so yeah 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 uh, that's fly yeah this um, flies so you know that's that's I don't miss that at all. I don't miss politics. I if I see something on Facebook regarding politics or you know anything like that, I just I delete it. Yeah, I don't give two don't fucks about it. any of that shit, man. Yeah. So let me yeah. ask you a question. Um, now my mom, for those of you who don't know, likes her 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 preference of man is is you know you you would say like a taller. Yeah, I love tall men. Like, I love like, European men. like, like six feet plus, like six foot, maybe six two, six four plus. Um, even six seven. Even six seven. I've so, gone out with guys six foot but seven. you said you went out with a six foot eight Swedish guy, right? Uh -huh. And he was just too tall. Yeah. So six foot seven is the cutoff. What about well, six seven and a half? It wasn't just that he was too tall. I guess what I couldn't grasp hold of, I mean, not literally, was the uh, his his shorts. I don't. Oh, okay. Like, like the shorts were here. Like his shorts were really short, like this, and you mean I don't know. you mean like the end of his shorts were that were down here? Yeah, they were almost like panty shorts. So but his he was so, so his big. so his dick was right in your face. No, 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 no. It's wait, wait, just wait, wait, the, wait, it, it was the tall? style. It was the style. No, the whole thing is he's so tall. He was so tall that he had to have his clothes custom made. Yeah, you're telling me. How that. much would that suck? I don't know. I mean, but although you probably they got do lots make of beautiful money. clothes, yeah. oh, maybe I don't <laughs> it's know. Probably money, higher quality. money doesn't impress me. It's mm. probably high, higher quality if you have a handmade. But um, yeah. So so yeah, with all the tall European guys here in Cambodia, <laughs> 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 there actually are a lot. So all right, because every because everybody is on the edge of their seat right now. They all want to know: Does yeah, my so mother? Sure. Does my mother think Cambodian men are attractive? Absolutely. Really. Yes. What'd you say? Okay, cool. At first, I didn't think so, but then I started seeing them and talking to them, and and uh, I guess what I like about it, they're just actually, say it. I don't know what I like about it. They just they're just were different. Hot. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah. Some, some uh, of them, some of them were very attractive. Fair, fair enough. Uh, just asking. Have, yeah. We all have different tastes. Um, right. 
you know, I mean, I like when they can speak English. Well, that's, I think that's a enough. A smile that's, is universal. That's, that's, that's one of the big things, guys, is, is the whole language barrier. I mean, that's, that's, that's one of the reasons that, reasons that I, and just one of the reasons why I probably will never date a Cambodian woman. It, it, like, if she speaks good English and we clicked, then great. I mean, who the hell is calling me during my damn video? So fucking rude. Um, all right, so we're going to wrap this one up. It's been over 10 minutes now. So this is my mother. By the way, you never said your name, did you? No, I didn't. My, well, I did well, say you it's did. Kim. It's, my name is Kim Augustine. Yes, that, that's, this is my now. mother's name. So great. You have, you have a bunch of new Facebook stalkers now. Awesome. Oh, great. Cool. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. no, I can <laughs> add it to the Nigerian one that I have. Oh. That I never met. All right, let's just. All right. So anyways, guys, you're going to go fuck yourself. Peace.